Yes, Virginia, there is a nursing shortage. This shortage has been recurring as a problem since the 1930s. Even with the addition of baccalaureate and associate degrees, there's still a shortage of nurses. According to the American Nurses Association, the United States needs to produce 1.1 million new registered nurses by 2022 to fill the newly created jobs and to replace the exodus of the retirees. Although the shortage needs to be addressed, the goal should be to find long-term solutions to this problem, which seems to cycle every 10 to 15 years. Besides retiring baby boomers, the shortage is exacerbated by nurses who are feeling burned out and unhappy and, and the advanced degree-seeking nurses who are moving away from the bedside. Turnover is extremely costly. It's estimated to cost about $60,000 to $80,000 to replace one nurse. During the usual 12 to 15 week orientation period then, the senior nurse has a lighter work assignment often and which reduces the number of people at the bedside caring for the people. Meanwhile, the new nurse sometimes feels a little discouraged and um, maybe powerless in her new environment. That can be a retention problem too. Other issues impacting nurse satisfaction and retention are salary and stress, long shifts, physical injury, the inability to feel like you're meeting the patient's needs. No wonder nurses are quitting. Let's work together to recruit more nurses and to retain the best we have.